Hello everyone and in this video we are going to make mirrors in car in Unity 5. First of all I'm going to show you what I have here. So I have a car and we have two types of reflections. First it's uh, exterior so it's outside reflection. It's what is reflecting from the street view. So you, you can see that in reflection we don't have interior of our car, we have only a street reflection. And in car, here, we have only interior reflection. And plus, we have correct reflection. So if you look here, you can see that actually we can see this. So what we should see in a normal car, right? And here we have also a uh, mirror number one and a mirror number two. So mirror which reflects uh, um, which reflects the exterior, so outside of car, also outside, outside of car, and a mirror that reflects inside of car, so interior. So. Let's just have a look uh, at what we have here. So we have basically two reflections, two probes, interior and exterior. So interior uh, has such uh, properties. It's real time, it's uh, refreshing every frame, every frame, and it has no time slicing. So we have it's like really, really expensive real time. If your PC is not very powerful, you can use this one. It's updating each frame in a delay of six frames, so it's not uh, uh, all at once. I mean, uh, it has delay, so your PC will be not very, not very tired. And this is extremely expensive, no time slicing. slicing. We have here such um, details, so it's not very good detail, you can see it. It's because it's interior reflection, so the player will be not uh, very, you know, uh, clearly see what we have here, because uh, it's not visible in fact, I mean, in fact, uh, very good in car. Of course, you can increase details like this, uh, but it uh, doesn't give you any, you know, good details at all because it's just uh, reflecting uh, you know back seat of car and what details you need it's uh, about exterior a reflection so I have here actually 512 and it's very good because we have good details on reflections and here we don't need such details so we just mm, make this number small and box projection enabled because this is mm, actually a box it's a flat surface while this surface is more organic so that's why I have here not box pro not box projection and very good details HDR and let's have a look at mask so in interior I have everything reflecting, every layer. In exterior I reflect everything except transparent FX. Transparent FX it's layer of my car. So we reflect everything except our car because if we refer if we reflect really everything, it will look like this. So it will uh reflect uh, not correctly. So it will reflect also interior but we don't need to reflect interior in outside reflection so that's why I have this option so only exterior only exterior is working good uh, with uh, this layer disabled so layer of car now let's look at how exactly I made two reflections war work together in the same object so okay, let's have a look. So I have here two very important materials. First, it's uh, my car um, material, so it's metal. 
metallic one smoothness one it's to make it very clearly visible details of reflection on my side of car on my metal and 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 that's all about this this is just a mesh renderer and uh, it just uh, our reflects uh, it just has our, our reflection of uh, of exterior exterior uh, zone so you, you can see that this zone is very big it's huge and also it's parented to my car interior zone is small and it's also parented to car small because it's only going to work with this mirror with this so and I have this object over here it's mesh renderer and I have here only one reflection probe working for for this mirror. So if I have it, if I have it like this, if I have it like this, like this, none. You can see that I I reflect uh, this probe. I reflect exterior now in mirror. You can see it. So the sky. And if I select a particular uh, probe. I go here, anchor override, and I select reflection probe interior. And you can see that I now uh, reflect interior of my car. And this is reflecting exterior, and this one is also exterior. So I'm going to go in this view, and you can see that now it's looking pretty, pretty good. So it does work. This is for uh, for. Uh, a reflection of back seat. Come on, you, you need to give me that chance. So back seat. Okay, I'm going to increase details so you could see that very good. So I go to my interior uh, probe and I increase value to this maybe. And you will be uh, and you will clearly see that it's working very good. So I have this. I'm going to pick play button. And you could clearly see that it's working very good. So I have this uh, reflection here, which is you know showing me this, and also I have reflection over here, which showing me this area. But uh, you can see that we don't see our car reflecting here. It's because this layer is, I mean, this reflection is for exterior uh, and exterior. A reflection doesn't uh, work with uh, um, with our car. So actually, I can uh, create here another probe, here probe, and here probe, and uh, apply separate a uh, reflection to this mirror. So let's just do this. So I hit play. I mean, I hit F. Okay, let's do this. I hit F, and I go here. Uh, light probe and I make it smaller because I don't need such such huge probe I make it smaller so okay hold a second this is so not comfortable to work with such small dots but it can be really easily done I make it smaller and smaller, but it's really it's really big impact on your performance such reflections. And if you are looking for uh, less effect of you know this, uh, you know FPS is very important for you, so you can I increase resolution and also increase I mean uh, not increase decrease resolution and uh, number of probes. And make it uh, and make it uh, um, refresh not w not without time slicing. I mean, uh, with uh, all at once, all faces at once. It's better for uh, low end PCs or middle end PCs. So okay, let's give a proper name to our uh, probe. Let's call it reflection probe uh, mirror 
left help. Okay, so we will leave it as it is. So we will just change this value, box, box, box projection, a projection. Okay, and now you can see that this box actually, this probe is affecting our exterior of car. So I mean, uh, it does affect our. Mm, so you can see it. So. And we don't want it to happen. We we don't want it to happen. So we are going to hit uh, this. I mean, we have to mm, separately take all our mesh renderers. I mean, all our parts and change here. So anchor override. So let's just. I'm not going to pick all the all the parts. I'm going to pick some 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 of the parts. Of, of my car, where this lock material is applied, and I'm going to change it to uh, interior. I mean exterior, and it will feel different. So exterior, and you can see that it it's not affecting my car. So, and we're not going to r really focus on you know the surface. We are going to focus on mirror now. So okay. And let's just uh, mirror L, and now we we have it parented to our car, and we go to this object, and we uh, select this probe mirror L, and you can see it here. And well, that's all for now. And you can see now that it does reflect now. It does now reflect our you know, real mirror here. So we have now uh, this reflection of our back seat. We have uh, a reflection of our exterior, so it's straight. And we actually c should move our uh, cube map, I mean this uh, helper, a little bit, so it will be not overlapping with our car. So let's just take it. We have this. Okay, uh, so let's just but okay it's not quite good I should do this instead I guess okay I'm not very familiar with this uh, operations yet because yeah, this is just so fresh so I think I should play it again so it will show me how it looks like Okay, you can see that you know there are logs, logs because I have a very crazy resolution. So I should go here and decrease resolution of, of interior to this number, f for instance. M maybe even this. A mirror should be also like okay, it's okay. So I you can see now. So we have this this um, reflection. And there's, but we you know we shouldn't change that one because we can see clearly on the only this mirror over here. And there is, you can see, uh, there is a black reflection. Black. It's a problem of Unity. I have no idea why it's working like this. But uh, if you reflecting. Uh, some object, you know, itself, so it will be black. I don't know why, so... It will be black for no reason, I don't know why. So we can see it's black. But I don't think it's very important, it's just working as it is. I hope this video helped you to have your reflections in your game, in your car. And this is how it works. So okay, let's just uh, let's just change it a little bit. Mirror no time slicing. Okay working 
so left mirror, front mirror, I mean that mirror. Just increase number of d details like this. Okay, it should not be like this. Mm, 200. Exterior. Interior. Okay, that's all. Thanks for watching. Have a good time. Bye bye. Bye bye. Have a good time. See you later in the next episode of something very interesting. I'm not very interesting. Bye.